Let's make a circle mask. Every so often on your UI, you're going to want it to have a circle mask. So let's do it. Super simple to do. Firstly, open up your UI. Here is mine. And you can see there's my existing one, but we'll just create another one up here. Firstly, add a retainer box like so. Give it a decent name. Oh, thing. And then inside of it, uh, once you've set the size, just add your image into it or whatever you want. Your text, I think it'll work as text. I can't see why not. Give it a little icon or something. And I'm going to set this to be my pistol. There we go. Just like that. Once you've done that, next we can go into the content drawer and we're going to create a new material. And we're just going to call this uh, Matt Circle Matt 2 because you can see I've already got my existing one. And we'll open this up. So in here, you're going to need to create a circular mask, just like this one here. I've created this one here, which I'll put in the description. It's just a literal black circle, well, a black background on a white circle. That's all you need to do. Once you're in there, drag your circle mask in like so. Drag off your RGB and multiply it to your A, just like so. Then we're going to click the final output thing and we're going to change the material domain to be user interface and then we're going to change the blend mode to be translucent like so. Next we're going to create a texture sample parameter 2D like so and give it a name but remember the name so I'm going to call it target because we'll need the name later. We're going to multiply from the A from here and we're going to add that into the multiply from the texture sample like so. We're going to drag the RGB into final color and we're going to drag the opacity into that just like that. As you can see, you should have a circle here. It looks very 2D. That's exactly what you need. If you don't have that, you've got a problem. Double check all the nodes, then go back to your UMG, and all you have to do is click on the top thing, what you've got, set the material to be what you, you set it. So I've got mask 2, and then set the texture parameter to what you've called it. And you'll notice nothing's changed, but once you start the game, you now have a circle mask that works fine. As you can see, I can pick up and I can update it just like normal, but it's rounded off. Thanks for watching. Enjoy.